Hi guys, it's Rich again with Pit Lane Sim Racing. I'm the very lucky owner of a Track Racer TR80 uh, Sim Rig, but as you may have noticed on the streams over the past few months, loads of people comment that I'm really close to the wheel. Now, it works really well for me and I feel really fast that way. And actually, it was a bit of a strange thing. When I first set up the rig and sat down in it, I also thought, I'm way too close here. This is never going to work for me. But then it immediately did and I felt really, really comfortable, really fast. And yeah, I just kind of stuck with it. Now, what I've noticed is since I've moved to the formula rim that I'm using, I'm getting a little bit of wrist ache and sometimes after prolonged use, a little bit of numbness in my fingers. And I think that's just because of the hunched up style, but I do race a lot more than most people. You know, doing three full Grand Prix a day is quite a lot for anyone. So this video is gonna be about me just adjusting the track racer rig to give me just a little bit more room at the wheel and uh, we'll see how that works out for me. So now the option is to move the wheel deck back a few inches. Now what I'm hoping to do is just loosen up the uh, tightening bolts that keep the wheel deck in place and then sort of shimmy it back on the main frame. I do want to point out though that this definitely isn't a fault with this rig. I am a very large guy who basically put it all together, sat in it and thought, this is amazing. But now after sort of prolonged use, I'm thinking, okay, maybe we need to just adjust the ergonomics of it and things like that. And I'm sure this is a very normal process for people to go through, but I just thought I would share that experience with you guys. So the first thing I'm gonna do is go over here and go into our tool selection. That's the, that's the batteries and here are the tools. And as what luck would have it, the very first Allen key in there is the one for doing this job. Let me just check in here. No, it is not. I am, I am telling porky pies. I think it's this one. Let's have a look. Will it go in? Yeah, there we go. Okay, so we have our Allen key. Now, in amongst these wires down here, which I'm gonna clear out, in there, you can see this sort of triangle piece. In there are some bolts that connect to the main frame here. I'm gonna loosen up these bolts. There's two this side, two on the other side, and also over on that side there as well. I'm just gonna untighten those, move it along a few inches, and then, yeah, there we go. And yes, I know, cable management, but this is actually right down by my side while I'm streaming. And while it looks incredibly untidy, this makes it super, super easy for me to reach and work with while I'm live, while I'm streaming, and then I can just um, adjust things as needed. So what we're gonna do is get down into this area, um, as I've just shown, and we're just gonna untighten some of the bolts. And as you can see, just to the left here, I've got a couple of inches to play with in that gap there, and that's what I'm aiming for. The camera's making this look filthy, but I can't even see this on the uh, sort of naked eye. So yeah, we're gonna get to untightening it, and uh, hopefully adjusting everything just a few inches forward. So I've got to admit, and I'm shocked, how much difference, just honestly, it was maybe two, maybe two and a quarter inches of distance between the wheel deck and where it's ended up. The difference in driving position, it feels really, really good. Now, I really do want to stress 
that I'm a particularly big guy. I'm six foot two, I'm very broad, I'm very big. So I'm positive, having seen so many photos and videos on this rig before, that everyone else is going to be absolutely fine. It's just when I set it up, I've got a stream schedule to keep, you know? I got it set up, I want it to be in it, I want it to be streaming. Had I not been a streamer, I probably would have taken the extra day or two just to fine tune it and get things right exactly how I wanted it. But this is my living, right? So I figured while I'm adjusting it, I'll make a little video and show you guys because some people seem to like the behind the scenes stuff. Um, again, I, I apologize for like cables and stuff like that all over the place. I realize so many of you are absolute perfectionists and things have to be just so. I have to do different bits and bobs almost daily to move my rig around, to move wires, to move cables, to change the setup. And yeah, I just have to be pretty dynamic to that. Um, so maybe, maybe, we'll see how this goes. I'll drive it for a week. We've got 15 Grand Prix this week on F1 2021. I'll see how it goes this week, and then we might see about maybe adjusting the pedal deck a bit further back so I can move the, I may be able to move the wheel deck a bit further back and things like that. Um, that's the beauty of rigs like this. You can do so much with them and they're totally customizable. So thank you for watching guys. Please make sure you're hitting that thumbs up and make sure you're subscribing. Cheers.